Hey guys, what is up? Goldglove here, and we are playing a game of Gotham City Imposters. And Imposters is spelled. Oh my god, did you see that no scope headshot? Because I sure as hell did. I tried to save my boy Slim Cognito, but it didn't happen. He ended up dying. But I got a nice little no scope for the first kill of the game for our team as I got stuck on the wall right there. But uh, I did play this a little bit more. Uh, I, last time I, I uploaded a video for this game, I ended up playing it uh, continuously that day, and I played with Slim, and it looks like Tucker uh, Jericho's in here. And so uh, here is some gameplay from that. Uh, it's probably not super, super, super good, uh, but it is a lot better than the very first game you guys saw from me. But, uh, I mean, the game is a lot of fun. I, I was getting frustrated a little bit just because um, it, it's a... It's a completely different game in the fact that you cannot play it like Call of Duty. If you play it like Call of Duty, then you will probably get your shit pushed in. And unfortunately, that was happening for me because I just have such a COD mentality. The way I play a first-person shooter is a lot like Call of Duty. And I need to get that through my head that that's not how it needs to be played, unfortunately. And so, uh, uh, I mean, not unfortunately. I mean, that's a good thing. Not every game should be co like Call of Duty. It should be different. But, um, so yeah, I mean, I need to get that through my head. I need to kind of change my gameplay based on that. But anyway, I didn't really want to talk about that. You guys know me. I don't really like to spend a lot of time talking about gameplay and all that stuff because the gameplay speaks for itself. I don't need to tell you guys exactly what's going on. But, um, as I missed two easy, easy snipes, that was just yikes. Yikesers. I thought this was a guy. I don't know why I shot him. Anyway, um... I wanted to talk about Mass Effect 3 is being released tonight. It is Monday the uh, the 5th. So it comes out uh, on Tuesday the 6th at midnight, which is tonight. And uh, so I'm going to be going to the midnight release with my boy Johnny. Most of you guys know who Johnny is. He's always in my Gears videos, and he's one of my good buddies. And, uh, you know, stuff like that. So John and I are going to go to the midnight release, pick up Mass Effect 3, and probably play it until our eyes bleed, which is completely fine with me because um, I love it. I absolutely love Mass Effect. Um, for those, some of you guys, you know, you, you saw, or a lot of you guys are like, wow, you're going to buy Mass Effect 3 when you haven't even played uh, Mass Effect 1 or 2. I don't know why people assume that, but um, I definitely have played Mass Effect 1 and number 2, and I've beat them both as well. I actually ended up beating the uh, first one twice within like a 24-hour span. I literally sat down and or no, it was a 48 hour span, but I spent 24 hours playing the game. Like that's how long I spent playing it um, in that short of a sp uh, span of time, which was ridiculous. I was obsessed with it. And um, I ended up beating it twice, once as a Paragon and once as a Renegade. And then um, I went on to Mass Effect 2 and I ended up beating it as a Renegade and I'm going to be doing the same thing in Mass Effect 3. So um, I'm going to be doing a Let's Play over my Let's Play channel. Uh, the link will be down below in the description for those of you who want to subscribe to that channel and prepare yourselves. Yeah. I will I'll probably upload a little announcement video over here on this channel so I can get as many viewers as possible for that series. It's going to be amazing. I am probably going to beat it within the first week um, and probably just pump out episodes, uh, episode after episode after episode just because I love Mass Effect so much. I could definitely see myself staying up until probably 9 or 10 a.m. tomorrow morning playing this game. So, uh, it's gonna happen. I, I absolutely love Mass Effect. I cannot wait. Um, I'm super, 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 super excited. I really, I really cannot emphasize how excited I am for this. I think I'm more excited for the Mass Effect 3 release than I was for the Gears of War 3 release, which is crazy to me. Um, after playing the demo and the multiplayer, there's gonna be, I'm gonna have tons of multiplayer videos for that game. I, John and I are gonna try to go, I, I think I'm gonna try to s do a series on that game where, uh, John and I try to win every single map on gold as we're playing the multiplayer which will be crazy we're gonna you know we're, we're gonna level up our characters we're gonna teach you guys uh, what setups to use and I'm gonna be doing tons of tips and tricks videos for that game so uh, that's something you guys can look forward to I hope you guys will enjoy that and uh, this video has got about two minutes left and I actually want to talk about something you know the, sometimes sometimes I look back like uh, actually uh, this is it's kind of ridiculous but I was actually talking to an old friend and and she was like uh, she, she told me to. She told me she found pictures of us when we were younger, and I was like, "Oh my god, I'm stuck right here." By the way, for those of you wondering why I'm like looking at, print. okay, anyway, um, and uh, so I went on my MySpace for whatever reason. I was like, "Let's go on MySpace. Let's look at all these old pictures. Let's read comments. You know, old whatever." And god damn, I was an asshole. I was an asshole to everybody, and and you know, I think about it, and it feels like a long time ago. But then again, it was only three years ago, or three or four years ago. 
Uh, I was about 17 years old, and and I and I'm only 20 now. I'm about to be 21, so it was about four years ago. Um, and and that's that's ridiculous to me. To the fact that I have changed so much, you know, I'm sure I can be an asshole now, but I'm nowhere near as big of an asshole as I was, and that baffles me. To to know that I have changed that much in just a or in just three or four years. Um, you know, how different am I going to be in another three to four years? You know, life has changed a lot, honestly. Um, you know, now I, I play video games. I mean, it sounds, it, it's not necessarily true, but I, I play video games for a living. You guys watch my videos, and usually most of them are gaming oriented. So I could say, you know, I play video games for a living. And, you know, this time in my life, I this is the least amount of video games I've ever played in my entire life. And it's funny because now it's actually something that I do to to, to live, to survive, right? I, I play video games, and that is, that's my job. And, uh, you know, three or four years ago, I wasn't making money from it, but I was playing video games constantly. I was, like, obsessed. And it's just crazy to think how life has changed since then. And just, a, and just that short of a span, you know, three to four years is not a long time when you think about it. And uh, life, life just changes so quickly, so... You know, make the best of it is what I would say. I mean, obviously you grow and, and you change. Even in a year span, you, you're a completely different person sometimes. Um, I mean, as you go older, as you get older, I think that changes. I, I think that the type of person you are doesn't drastically change as much from, you know, than when you were younger. But uh, it's still, it's kind of cool to think about. It's kind of, it's kind of weird. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully I threw up some other gameplay while the other game ended. But uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a like. Be sure to subscribe to my Let's Play channel if you guys are uh, looking forward to my Mass Effect 3 Let's Play. And if you guys are, I will see you tonight in my first episode. It'll be up probably about uh, 1 or 2 a.m. Pacific time. And uh, I'll see you guys then.